When a demo didn't go to plan, a young Hans-Jörg Gerber knew things could be better. And so begins a journey from then till now. And we kept on going. In 1971, Hans-Jörg Gerber created the first Thermomix. If all we wanted was to make a food processor, we would have stopped long back. But we wanted to create an extraordinary experience, which is why we're still going. Then, now, always. Thermomix. Hello, good morning everyone. So today I'll be hosting this English demo event that will be demonstrating the uh, the function of Thermomix to you all. So uh, good morning everyone. We have 21 participants here. Can you all hear me? Can you give me a one if you can hear me? So I can ensure everyone can hear my voice. Okay. Morning Wenzi, morning Anna, morning Brian. Good morning, everyone. So can I know, uh, like, any of you here have Thermomix? Do you have Thermomix at home? Is it a TM5 or do you don't have a Thermomix at home? So if you have TM5 at home, can you give me a 5? If you don't have, can you give me a 0? So I can know, like, if anyone doesn't have a Thermomix at home. Brian say he don't have Thermomix at home. Okay, some people have TM5. Okay, so today we will be demonstrating this uh, TM6 function, which is the latest version of Thermomix. So yeah, so let me share a PowerPoint for you all. So let me share a little bit story uh, about myself first. So my name is Yuan. I will be hosting this event today. So I'm actually a Thermomix user for almost like uh, three and a half years already. And I used to be a TM5 user and I converted to this TM6 since uh, uh, last year, end of last year. So I really love how this, uh, how this uh, TM6, the upgraded version, because it has like really a lot more function as compared to this TM5. And the function inside is much more advanced and it really helps to ease the process uh like my cooking process uh. so i really think it's a very very good uh very very good uh kitchen appliances yeah so uh today we have something special for all of the participants here today we'll be uh doing a lucky draw so maybe i can uh ask anna to uh tell us more about this lucky draw today hello good morning everybody okay so um we'll be we'll be giving out stuff yeah can i share screen yeah of course yeah so i will show you all the gift box that radiant whole food is gonna give us all right so mm -hmm. under the chat below i'm gonna send you all the link for you all to register give me a sec Mm, yeah. let me get <laughs> so you all need to register under this link so we we will have this uh name list for for us to 
to choose the winner. So don't lose your chance. We only have 30 participants here today. So the, the, the chance of getting the prize is really quite high. Lah. So remember to register. That's right. Okay, I'll you, check. You my oh, there you go. Yeah, this is the link. And if you can see my screen, this is the gift box. It's worth 50 ringgit. All right, yeah. so we have brown sugar, we have chia seed noodle, we have sea salt, and also sesame oil. Okay, so the yeah. gift box is the gift box is worth fifty ringgit. So if you don't happen to get chosen, or or yeah, you can actually key in our voucher code Salmon Shasho for our fifteen percent discount. Okay, and it's unlimited use. All right. Yes. So about this uh, Radiant Whole Food, they are a pioneer in organic food, all right? So they've been in a market for over 20 years already, okay? So, and we are also, and they are also halal certified, all right? So really mm. um, thankful for yeah. Radiant Whole Food for being our sponsor for today, okay? So yeah, so register yeah. because we are opening, we are closing our, our thing soon. Yes. Uh, like the cutoff time, I think is like uh thirty minutes. Ah, eleven fifty. Yeah. Yeah. So remember to do click on the link and register. Yeah. So we will have a name list from the link. Yeah. So now I'm giving everyone like uh maybe a five minute time to click on the link to register. Anyone register already? Click one. Who who haven't registered? Click zero, please. So I know. <laughs> Can I have more one number one? Yeah. Okay, I saw many people like click on the link to register already. Invite your friends as well. Invite your friends to kind of watch us, okay? It's yeah. Like, you know, we are very lucky to have this um uh Radiant Whole Food to sponsor us because like it is a really a recognized uh brand on the market. Like, you can really find it in the supermarket one. Uh in the organic the information. Sorry, who is that? <laughs> Okay, so okay, now we are going to start our our uh, presentation for this uh, TM6 today. Okay, so let me start now. So good morning, everyone. Today we will be demonstrating a few dishes using this uh, TM6. So we will have uh, two presenters that will be demonstrating four dishes today. So we didn't like, we aim to finish in one and a half hour time. So we aim to do four dishes. Sylvia so will be doing lemonade and one more is pumpkin manto. This pumpkin manto is really very nice. So later we'll be demonstrating how easy it is to use, uh, to make manto with thermomics. And then Anna will be demonstrating the like buffet style <laughs> curry chicken and, uh, sorry, curry pork and this, uh, uh, stir fry mihun, which is something always on the buffet menu. Okay, Angel say estimated how long it takes for TM to upgrade the model, and old model can trade into new model. Okay, let me share with you this PowerPoint slide. Okay, sorry, I'm not very good at <laughs> controlling. Okay, so welcome everyone to our thermomics experience. May I, can I know if uh like what is important to you when cooking? Is it like money saving, reliable, easy, healthy, or, or is it creative? To me, creative is very important to me because I have eight family members to feed every day. So I really need to, you know, uh keep on uh changing dishes and you know, uh, to make something that they will like. Lah. So, or is it time saving? Or maybe you are a stay at home mom or you really have very limited time and you want to cook something really simple and quick, then you can have a healthy and easy meal every day. Yeah, maybe you all can let us know which is more important to you. So let me share a little bit about this uh, Thermomix. So Thermomix is a brand from Germany and uh, the company name is Worldwide. Actually, this Worldwide company already existed since 135 years ago and they have received a lot of awards and recognitions over the years. Yeah. So just now someone uh, actually asked me, is TM6 this latest version? Yes, TM6 is the latest version already and it's uh, recently launched in uh, 2019. So as you can see, the reason why there's an upgraded version from 5 is because the innovation from the technology and things like that, everything needs to upgrade. So imagine you're using uh, maybe an iPhone 5 now. You feel like 
you are so laid back already and you need something more advanced. So that's why there's a latest version for this um, TM. And in, as you can see, the screen is bigger and uh, this system, right, it will upgrade like from time to time. So when they upgrade the, the Thermomix from the system, right? So as long as your TM6 is connected to Wi-Fi, it will upgrade itself and it will alert you to upgrade your own Thermomix. So as you can see last time, uh, we actually posted about this new function, which is like a peeler and wash kind of thing that is an extra accessories. So when the item is launched in Malaysia, right, then you will have this upgraded version also. So you don't have to worry like you are using this uh, older version or that is there any like TM7 coming out soon. So I really don't think so because they already have a new uh, accessories and there's something go, uh, like they are producing new products from there, but it's not it's not TM7. Nah. So uh, you, as you can see from the history chart, they almost take like at least 10 years to upgrade a newer version because of the innovation of the of the technology. But I don't think it will happen. It will happen soon. Nah. Yeah. So this TM6 is like a world best seller all-in-one super kitchen machine. And they are the first inventor for this all-in-one kitchen tools. So uh, it is really hot selling until like uh, every 20. Three second, they sold one Thermomix worldwide. Lah. So when you received, uh, when you buy this Thermomix, right, all these accessories will be included, like the one you see here, the, the bigger one, which is a Varoma tray, we call it a Varoma tray, and slash guard, measuring cup, everything will be included. So you don't need to pay extra money to buy extra accessories. It's not needed. So you have everything you need here. So yeah, Thermomix is uh, now, is a uh, uh the price is six thousand nine hundred nine hundred and eighty eight, and we do have installment payment. So if you are interested to know more about the installment payment, you can uh just just contact to the advisor that uh invited you to this event. So as you all know, right? We we, we all along the years we always buy like you know, uh tiny little kitchen appliances. Uh, this and that, uh, maybe like soybean maker or maybe like small little blender to blend your garlic and things like that or maybe a juicer or you know like all sorts of things, pressure cooker, rice cooker. You have a lot of things at home but actually you only need one thermomix because it can replace all of the machine that I mentioned above. So today I'll be uh, letting these two presenters to present what we can do with this thermomix. So first, can we have um, Suyen to do manto? Yes. Hello. Hi, everyone. Yeah. Hi, Suyen. Good morning. Good morning. Okay, today I'm going to make pumpkin manto. So uh, this is, uh, maybe I'll show you this. Let me just turn it. Okay, so if you can see it here, I have added this recipe to my week. So here are all the steps. Okay, I have, okay, this is Mandarin, but actually we also have an English version. So I have already seen my pumpkin, so I can straight jump to this third step. So when I click it here, actually it will go straight and ask me what I need to put in. Okay. All right, so now I need to put in the yeast. So I'll show you later, how do we actually wake this yeast up because of the temperature control. Okay, so I add in the yeast. And next. Okay, I add in the water. You can also use milk. And now it asks me to cover the leads. And the next step is to activate the yeast. So over here, we actually use a 37 degree Celsius. If you can see, uh, it needs two minutes and then it starts to 37 minutes uh, with a speed, zero, speed 0 0.5 to uh, activate this yeast. 37 degrees is the best temperature to actually wake up our yeast. Because you know yeast is the very problematic thing 
when we are in making bread or in making mantou, uh, because when the yeast is not uh, wake up, then probably your mantou cannot prove well. When you steam it, it doesn't look nice. And uh, when your environment, the temperature is too cold or too hot, then your yeast also not wake up well. When it's too cold, then it's like sleepy yeast. And when it's too hot, then it's like uh, too, active, too active. So this 37 degrees Celsius is the best temperature to actually wake up our yeast. That's the best thing uh, in thermomix uh, of this consistent temperature that we have. In a lot of dishes, we can control it so well. So all uh, the bread or the mantle that uh, we made out of thermomix is uh, always foolproof, uh, fail-proof, sorry, yeah. Okay, so yeah. I'll need another 30 seconds. Okay, so, so uh, a lot of time, right, when we do this uh, mantle or maybe things that need to prove, right, you probably need to depend on the environment or you need to depend on today's weather and to decide whether you can prove a very well mantle. And you need a lot of experience and a lot of uh, uh, field experience to know that uh, whether your your mantle is proved well and things like that. So with Thermomix, right, as you can see, she even actually fixed the temperature at 37 degrees. So uh, during the two minutes time, right, it will um, it will maintain at 37 degrees. So a lot of kitchen appliances cannot do that because they cannot control the temperature. But with Thermomix, you can, um, you can really uh, set the temperature at the very, very specific uh, temperature. Yeah. Okay, so now it's already done. And uh, I need to add in the flour. Okay, and we have this built-in skill. So you don't need to take a separate uh, bowl to actually weigh your ingredients. Like, you know, a lot of time in baking, we always need like uh, use a lot of... Okay, even if it is too much, I can actually just scoop it up. Bit. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. So as you can see, it has a built-in scale already. So uh, you can actually um just measure everything in. Like for example, if you are using a, a stand mixer or things like that, it doesn't have like any scale on it. So you need to have a separate scale, and you need a lot of different different bowls uh, to measure all your ingredients before putting it in. So we are doing everything at the same time in one thermomix only. Yeah. So you really uh, wash lesser bowls and things like that. Yeah. Hmm. Okay, so next I put, I already put in the uh, pumpkin and now I'm adding the sugar. So again, it will have these skills for you to straight away weigh your sugar. Okay. You can put in less or more sugar. It's up to your preference. You no need to follow exactly the recipe here. So it's uh, based on uh, what you like, then you just add it in. Okay, next is the oil. Yeah, so a lot of time where right, you need to depend on one recipe. Maybe you need to hold your phone on your hand and, you know, watch the video over and over again and again. Repeat so many times. But with Thermomix, you don't need to have a, a book in hand or maybe a phone in hand. You just follow everything on the screen. Yeah, okay. So the next step is it will help us to knead the dough. So we need three minutes here. I'll show you later how it looks like when it's kneading. And imagine like if you need to knead the dough yourself using your hand, it's so messy, right? Yeah. And this one helps to do, I always like Thermomix because it always helps to do the um, kneading hard work. Yeah, and leave us <laughs> the bad part. <laughs> you can see. Yeah. You know, like uh, it's so healing when we made bread or we made like a uh, pile. We like to do the rolling, the shaping, but we hate doing this part. Yes, so we hate it doing this part. Us. Yeah. Especially you need to dig your fingers in and make sure your dough is very, very well mixed. You know, actually, you don't know uh, how well it can mix because you are just agar agar or things like that. Nah. So sometimes, hey, maybe uh, you see other people do like that, but you own self do until so messy. Okay. <laughs> so you really hate the process. Lah. So... 
yeah, when technology can help us, right? Why not? You know, last time we used to use our hand to wash clothes, but now we don't use hand anymore. We use washing machine. So it's the same concept. Now we have a cooking machine to help us. So why why do we still use hand? Yeah. Yeah. Especially for kneading part. I, I, I'm sure many people don't like kneading. <laughs> Who likes kneading? Yeah. We, we only like the fun part. So if you have kids at home, right, you can engage them for uh, activity like that. Like maybe you can do a baking session uh, in the weekend or you can just ask them to help you do like very simple shaping, like engage them uh, during the cooking process. Yes. Yeah. That's very fun. Yep. So, yeah, so later Syrian will be doing the uh, shaping and uh, cutting and then she will put uh, the thing on the steam, steam tray, then everything will be done already. Yeah. yeah. So oh, maybe okay. you can Let show us my... how it looks like inside. Huh? All right. Yep. Can... I need to get my silicone mat. <laughs> I forgot to. All right. So now. Yeah. As you can see just now, right? Whatever she put in is flat and everything loose. As you can see now, yeah. Tomomix is forming a dough for, for her. You see? So yeah. you can use this mode, right? To do your uh, ban min, the meat ban min. Like every time we need to do meat ban min, maybe... You don't know how to do so you can you can do meat ban min uh, or maybe you want to do meat, uh bread or anything in a dough form okay let me get my silicon mat i'll get ready for the shape yeah so have any of you tried doing bread making at home if you all tried can you give me a minute? Yeah, who likes baking? I yeah, love baking a lot. <laughs> Lily, Lily said one, yeah. Yeah. So I'm sure the process, like maybe the manual process is uh, maybe much of a hassle because you really need to clean a lot of things. And then your tabletop will occupy a lot of space. And yeah, I see Syrian done her dough already. Yeah. Okay, so I just need to... Turn the turn it. Yeah. Yeah. And it will come out. So and you see the, the dough, dough is like removed from the bowl and colorsly one. Mm. Yeah. And the dough made by Thermomix, right? No it's always very easy and... to handle. Yeah. It's not sticky. And then this is inside. And I just need to put in water and I can use the machine to do the pre-cleaning for me. So I no need to wash with my hand. And I can use this time to shape my dough. Yeah. Yeah, so, so maybe, maybe just... you put the water and show us the pre-clean. Okay, this one, I just cover it up first and let it rest. And then I'll mm -hmm. clean the clean the uh, bowl. Okay. Yeah. As you can see, right, actually, uh, Thermomix only need a very, very small part of your kitchen. And then you can... You can utilize all the function of it already. For example, you want to steam things, it will just, you only need like a A4 size space. You don't really require a very big space. You know, some people, they're home, right? On the tabletop, they have pressure cooker, they have rice cooker, they have steamer, they have Hello, steam mixer, like they have blender, they have everything on the tabletop. It will look really very messy. But we all now, right, the newer version, I mean the, uh, now we have this thermomix. You can really do like all this, all this, all these things, right? Replace into one already, and you only need one A4 size space. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. So now I can. Just now I'm in the recipe, so it's at this step. So I need to. The next step is actually asking me to prove the dough, so I can actually go back to our this function pre clean, and we have actually four. Functions here, we have dough, all-purpose, fat and caramels, and brown uh, bottom. So I'm making mantou, so I just need to use the dough mode to pre-clean mm. it. Yeah. Yeah. Like, it's really easy, especially as uh, uh, it can clean itself. You know, you leave all the hassle to your thermomix. You don't need to bother about it. You just do the fun part, which is shaping. Yeah. So now, while it's cleaning, I'll do my shaping. Yeah, she'll do her shaping. 
Okay. Yeah, so while you do your simple shaping, maybe I will pass to uh I'll pass to Anna, Anna to do your stir fry bihun. Anna is waiting. <laughs> Hi, good morning, Anna. Good morning, everybody. Okay, so I'll be making stir fry bihun. <laughs> Sorry, yeah. Okay. okay, and now you can start your stir fry bihun today. All right, so it's pretty easy. I'll be halving all my recipes because just for myself and my husband. All right, so y'all can see my screen, right? It's pretty clear, right? Okay, so it's pretty easy. Um. Okay, so just let me go through. We don't want to make sure we have these three knobs things. So this will show the time. The middle one will show you the temperature. And the last one will show you the speed, all right? So if you can actually see, right? Wow, that hurt. Okay, if you can actually see, let me put you closer. Can you see over at the speed there, there's a blade? If you can see the blade there, give me a one. Can I have people talking in the chat, please? Can you all see the blade? Yes? All right, perfect. Okay, so one magical thing about this is that when you press this, right, you can actually press this blade thing and it becomes a reverse. Okay, so what is this function? Okay, let me show you, okay? So in our thermomix, right, there's a blade, all right? So the blade is always in our thermomix, all right? So why we have this reverse function is because, so it's like any other blender, our blade, ha our blade has the sharp side and also the blunt side, okay? So when it's reversed at time, you will actually go anti-clockwise, okay? So when it's blade, it will actually go um, clockwise so that it will cut whatever that we want to chop or whatever we want to mince or turbo or whatsoever or turn um, rock sugar into icing sugar or any hard things, let's say um, herbs or whatsoever, like cinnamon quill or cinnamon stick, you can actually turn it into powder as well with our blender, with our, with our blade, okay? So only Thermomix is patented with this function, all right? With this of amazing design that we can go forward and also backwards, all right? Okay, so without, so to fix it back, it's actually very easy. Just put back your blade, aim it properly into the hole. So basically you have to align properly. All right, and then the base, just lock it down like this and then close, just like so. All right, so if you're wondering, can you actually wash your whole bowl? Yes, you can, all right? This five pins, you can also wash it. So basically you can submerge everything into the water, but when you were to actually attach your bowl into onto your machine you have to make sure these five pins are dry okay because they're actually connected to our machine so you have to make sure that it's dry or else it's not covered by warranty okay so you have to bear all the consequences by yourself right so i'm going to start with b1 first so i actually have it in my um cookie dough already i already saved it under my week so i'll be making this stir fry stir fry mihun okay so if you if you are curious to see what are the ingredients, you can actually just swipe up. So here are all the ingredients. Okay, so it's pretty easy. So because it's guided cooking, just go start cooking. All right. So place twenty. Grams. I use only half a portion, so I'm just gonna put ten grams, um, and then shallot or onions, just 10 grams as well. Okay, and then I'm going to chop it. So to chop it, I just have to replace the, the lid with the measuring cup, okay? Don't forget to put your measuring cup. Put it on. So see, everything is really set for you. The only thing you need to do is just turn the selector, okay? To speed six, yeah. all right? So as long as you know how to read, all this thing is super. Yes. Okay, so when it's done, there will be sound. Mm. Yeah. Okay, let me show you how fine the choppings are. Yeah, oh, yeah not very bright. Come on. Can see? Yeah. Yeah. Nah? Okay, so basically now I need to scrape the sides, okay? So after I scrape the sides, we're going to saute it. Yeah, so actually you are doing the blending and the sauteing in the same bowl. You see, Anna, don't even take out her chopping board to chop onions and chop garlic. Come on. <laughs> yeah, super easy. Okay, so you know how they always say, right? Like olive oil is not recommended for cooking. But with Thermomix, we can because it's um, our temperature is being controlled. So it's okay to use olive oil. It won't turn into toxic or whatsoever. Okay, so I'm just going to make half portion. So it's 25 grams. 
So see, if you actually get your kids to cook, right? What's so cool about this machine is that if you're cooking for two person, you can have the recipe and then you can make your kids work their math. Okay, so it's like, it's like all in one go, math, yeah. reading, see. Yeah, as you all can see, right, a lot of advisors or a lot of TM users actually engage their kids during their cooking process, which is, uh, I, I, I really think it's a very, very good thing lah, because back then we used to avoid people, avoid kids to go uh, into the kitchen because it is so dangerous. Anna, is your site okay? It looks like something is jamming. <laughs> okay, we'll wait for Anna to come back. So uh, one thing that I, I really love is that I like to engage my kids uh, during the cooking process because I really think it's a very, very fun process. And then, yeah, so last time we always avoid kids to go inside the kitchen because it is so dangerous. We are still using gas, fire and things like that. So it is very, very dangerous and scary. Lah. So yeah, so let me share with you all some information about this thermomix. So yeah, if you are single or if you are just married couple or if you have uh, kids at home or if you are a retired uh, person already, uh, all this thermomix is suitable for all kinds of lifestyle. So I think uh, one thing great about this thermomix, right, is to allow you to do something, uh, food that is fast and fresh every day. As you can see, uh, Siri, Siri just now uh, did the mantle, right? It's like really from scratch. I really think this is something very, very uh, meaningful to me that I can do things from scratch, which is, which is something very amazing. Uh, like back then, I wouldn't think of doing mantou or maybe uh, bread at home, but Thermomix allows me to do that. And it's really a healthier and um, much better version of food for my family. La. And then later, we'll talk about this cookie dough. Anyone is interested with cookie dough, or you always heard about this cookie dough, but you don't know what's happening. So maybe you all can give me a one if you're interested to know more about this cookie dough. Give me a one, please. Can I have more interaction in the chat room? <laughs> Krishnan said, is this machine can cook the same time many dishes? Yes. If you are doing like um like a uh, steaming food, as you can see, right? Here you can cook soup, right? Here you can uh, steam a chicken or up here you can steam a vegetable or things like that. So uh, if you are doing something that is steaming, you can do a lot of things at the same time. So yeah. And so many people are interested with this uh, cookie, cookie, cookie do, right? Can you give me a one if you are interested to know more about uh, cookie do? Yeah. So later we'll talk in depth. So Yun will uh, explain more in depth about this cookie do, cookie do for us. So now back to Anna. Anna is back. Surprise. Welcome back. <laughs> okay. So basically I put in my cabbage. So next, uh, it'll be four minutes. I'll put it, um, so it's already set on Varoma. So the only thing I need to do is just turn the cursor to um, spoon stir. All right. Okay, that's all. Let's see the questions. So there's people asking, uh, I mean, example, I fry the mihun and my mother wants to use the blender. Okay, if there's something happening in the mixing bowl, so you cannot do like at the same time because got food inside. Ma. So after you are done already, you can just clean it off and just blend whatever you want. Maybe you want to blend a, a, a chili to pair with your... Uh, pair with your um, stir-fried bihun, right? Because... The blending part only requires few seconds. For example, last time, right, I did uh like Hainanese uh, Hainanese uh chili. You know, you need a lot of time to blend every single thing. So I just put all the ingredients in. All I need is two seconds, and that's really fast. And you can leave the thermomix to clean itself. You don't need to uh go through all the hassle. Yeah, and now your side there, okay? Yeah, perfectly, oh, perfectly fine. So what I'm doing now, uh, what the Thomas is doing now for me is uh, we're cooking the cabbage and also mm -hmm. sauteing the garlic and also the, shall the shallots. All right, so it says to soak the mihun for a minute. So while this is going on, my mihun is actually soaking for a while. Later, I will show you how I actually 
No, I won't show you. I will just show you after how I actually drain the water, okay, using the aroma ditch, all right? It's like all in one function, okay? So yeah. it's actually quite cool. All right, so I've got another two minutes and 17 seconds. Do you have any questions for us? Yeah, I see someone here said that just now, uh, like some people asked whether they can do same thing at the same time, right? So yeah, we do have like a double bowl promotion if you refer a friend to us. Yeah, if you refer a friend to your advisor and then you can get a, another bowl for like 50% off and that's a really good deal because this uh, mixing bowl already costs like maybe uh, over 1000 Yeah, so now you can get it around 600 only. So Kristen said that uh, lotus root soup, I think my mother-in-law said the ceramic pot makes more nice fragrance. So if you do have such uh, preference, you can leave the soup to cook in your uh, ceramic uh, pot is okay one it's not like uh, after you use the mix you can throw away all your kitchen appliances I really don't think so I, I just think that this the mix really helps to ease our uh, cooking process like for example you want to peel your garlic skin or maybe things that uh, requires more hassle maybe soup is something very easy right just throw the ingredients in if you have some your preference you can just use the uh, same one like you can use this thermomix for other function like for example you want to make lemonade you want to make mantou this is something that your ceramic pot cannot do for you yeah so yeah there is a double bowl promotion so if you are interested you can contact your advisor for more information yeah so now uh, while Anna is cooking Anna uh, you are at which process already maybe you can let us know I saw her screen like maybe Sure, so we've got another 36 seconds, 30 seconds, all right, so yeah. So, so Anna, see. as you can see, she's walking everywhere because the thermomix is doing the job for her. And yes. if you don't have a thermomix, you, can, you must stand there and watch everything to go, you need to go through the whole process, like the whole five minutes, the whole four minutes. And she's walking here and there doing her own things, cleaning up the kitchen because she is, she has the time to, yeah. Mm. That's right. And you see, I'm actually so near my thermomix. Okay, I'm actually I'm actually like making like a, a mild speed. Okay. Yeah. Because if I have to stand out, you can I actually see marks face. Okay, all right. So there you go. My cabbage is actually done cooking-ish. So the next thing I need to do is press next. All right. And then put in water. So half of 500 will be 250. Yeah, so when you are cooking, right, last time, like, uh, when you stir fry your bihu, maybe what, uh, when you reach the another step already, but you need to go to the toilet. <laughs> your, 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 your bihu is cooking in a pot. You cannot, like, uh, stop doing anything. You just need to complete the task, then only you can leave the kitchen. But with thermomics, you can just stop anytime, and maybe you can ask your husband, hey, uh, come and continue the whole process. Yes, then he will know water. how to do because the cookie do will guide it. That's yeah. right. Okay, so like soy sauce in already. So dark soy sauce. If you like your, your noodles to be dark, you can put dark soy sauce or else you can opt this one out. Oops, a little too dark. Okay, one teaspoon of white pepper. Yeah, as you can see, everything is guided. So if like here is for the flavoring. So if you have like specific uh, preference, maybe you don't like dark soy sauce, you like oyster sauce, you can replace it. It's okay. So Lisa said, do we have to follow exactly the recipe or we can opt out of any of them? Yes, you can opt out any of them, but maybe the water and the, the mihun amount have to be uh, according to the recipe. Yeah. So it's just like cooking in, the, in your pot lah. So like, just like on your frying pan, it's the same. So if you add additional water, your, your mihun will be very too soggy. So once you get the amount of water, right, then you, you are, you're good to go. You want to put any kind of seasoning, seasoning so, so can man. You don't have to like really follow the exact recipe. So with this recipe, you can cook like many kinds. Siam mihun, or tom yam mihun, fried mihun, or you want to do koro mi fen. Also the same concept. So we up out soya sauce, we have to replace the same great, uh, gram. Uh, I do think that the grams is very, very little, maybe like 10 grams to 5 grams, like 1 teaspoon. I don't think it will do very much of a difference. Like. Mm. Yeah, so because you are replacing maybe with the oyster sauce. Nah. So you can just uh, replace the same amount of oyster sauce into it. Nah. 
Yeah. So do you have uh, anyone else have uh, any more questions? Everyone? <laughs> okay. So now, uh, while waiting for Anna to cook, I'll explain more from my slides. So what else can this thermomix do? So yeah, like just now Syrian do did this mantle, right? So you want to make a bread, you want to make your own pasta, like you want to make ban mian or you want to make your own fish ball, also can because the need uh the kneading process is only two minutes and you can pre-clean to get all the uh all the dough chunks and everything out. You don't need to use your hand. Yeah. So also tomorrow can make your own ice cream. For example, you have extra berries at home. So you can freeze them and just blend them with your thermomix and it will become a very, very yummy ice cream. And I do think it's a much healthier option for your kids. Like for example, it is very fun, no coloring and no preservative. You do feel safe if you are doing like yeah, you, you are giving your kids to eat this uh fruit sorbet or things like that. Uh. So um, Tomomix is also using this low temperature healthy cooking. So you are cooking this, if you are cooking this um, broccoli, right? The broccoli you, get, you can see right from Tomomix is really much greener, much sweeter because it can retain the nutrients into the, uh, into the veggies. So you are eating all the healthy nutrients instead of like maybe we go through uh, like very high temperature, right? The nutrition will uh, lost during the cooking process. Lah. Yeah, so Thermomix, uh, one of the special features is that it has special temperature control. Like for example, melting chocolate. If you are a fan of baking, you know melting chocolate is such a hassle because it is really uh, so annoying. You need double boil. You need to ensure your uh, chocolate is in the right temperature. But for us Thermomix user, we just throw the chocolate in and we leave it anytime you want, like maybe 20 minutes and it will stay at the melting point of the chocolate. Because the melting point for chocolate is 50 degrees. Ma. So it will stay at the state for like maybe 20 minutes according to the time you set. La. Yeah, so Kaya. Kaya is something I never thought of doing. But with Thermomix, I did so many times already. Yeah. So imagine you do Kaya at home, right? You need to stir, stir, stir. Or maybe fruit jams if you did. La. So there's a chance that you can burn your pot and a lot of hassle to go through. But with Thermomix, you really don't need to go through that much of hassle. Yeah, so uh, and now your site done. Anna, <laughs> okay, maybe I'll pass this. Uh, is sorry, sorry, time? sorry. <laughs> okay, I've got another one minute. So probably Suyun, would you like yeah, to take Suyun, over? Maybe we'll get Suyun to do the to do the lemonade. Yes. Okay. So maybe I'll show you the pre-clean. Just now I use the pre-clean functions to clean it. And I just rinse with water and it's very clean. Can you see? Yeah. Yeah. So, uh, and just now, I just want to add on to whatever Yuan and uh, Anna has said. Like, big, uh, cooking uh, bihun is so convenient. Like, last time, if we cook on wok, we need to soak it first, like, at least, like, uh, a very long time. Like, at least half to one hour la, to make it soft. But cooking with thermomix, you do not need to pre-soak your bihun maybe just like one minute uh, like just clean it then you can cook already same goes to other uh, me as well we can straight away put in like e me you know need to like actually uh, soak it or whatever so now i'm going to make a lemonade uh, i will add in the rock sugar and then with just uh, two seconds turbo i can turn this rock sugar to powdered sugar so you can see this big, the rock sugar. I'll just throw it in and I can turn it into powder. I'll show you the magic in a while. Okay, let me just weigh my sugar. So uh, we have the lemonade recipe in Cookie Do. There are a few of them. You can choose whichever that you like. And for the sugar, you can also adjust yourself how sweet you want it to be. So I'm just putting in like a 60 gram. Uh, instead of the recipe call for 100 grams. Uh. So I'll turn to turbo. Two seconds. So since it's a rock sugar, so when it's blending it, it will be slightly loud. So just bear with me. Okay. And I'll do it one more time to make it finer. All 
All right, we are done in, in four seconds. Okay, I'll open it slowly because it's in powder form. So there might have some powder flying up. Okay, now I'll show you. So now my rock sugar has turned to powder. Okay. Now I'll be adding in my lemonade. So for the lemonade, we just need to carve it like this with the skin on and even with the seed on. Okay. You can hear me, right? Because it's like so quiet. Yeah, I can. can. <laughs> Maybe okay. that's because I'm not talking. <laughs> all right, all right. Okay, so I add the lemonade in, I'm oh, sorry, the lemon in, and then I'll now put in some water. So I open up the scales and just add in the water. I'll add in 500 grams of water. Okay. And now we will turn it to turbo again. And with another two seconds, our lemonade is done. So, Mr. Momix, your juicing process is only two seconds. Yeah. <laughs> Imagine you so, need to squeeze with the hand. <laughs> yeah. Okay. Yeah, the usual way you need to squeeze with your hands and uh, your, your fingers will really very pain uh, because the lemon is very sour. Uh. Yeah. yeah, and also the skin of the lemon is quite thick actually. So now I'll add on the remaining water and I can use our simmering basket to strain it out, okay? So yeah. now. So uh, the, the accessories for this thermomix, right, you can use it in many, many different ways. Like for example, now Siu Yun is uh, using it to strain her juice to, uh, to avoid the skins and the, the seed to come out. Lah. So this basket, you can also use it uh, to cook rice, maybe to blanch your meat and really a lot more function that you can do with this basket. Yeah. Later, I'll show you how the skin look like. And I'll try to find if there's any seed inside. You will be amazed with this. You know, we call this blade like they it's a it's a PhD or a doctorate blade, like it can blend things into powder. Yeah. And when you uh blend the lemonade, it can leave you with the skin on and even the seed on. But at the same time, you can fry bihun, it won't cut your bihun. So it's like so cool, this blade. All right, so this is how the skin look like. The skin is still like one whole piece and it's so like all the flesh is out, but the skin is not cut. Yeah. So it only cut away the pulps. Uh. Yeah, yes. the skin is still complete. Uh. I'm not sure if I could find any seed. Like this lemonade don't have much seed. <laughs> Oh, lucky <laughs> you. Okay. okay, for the usual one, right, if we do have seed, because we are using the turbo function, but it will not uh, break the seed, you know. Yeah. Yeah, it then your lemonade will turn to bitter. La. Yeah. Your lemonade won't turn bitter because it didn't break the seed. Yep. Yep. So that's and then the lemon skin, right? You can use it as a normal, uh, as a natural detergent. You don't throw away the skin. Yeah, it's a very good uh, natural detergent uh, to clean your yeah. bowl. All right. Later, I can use this to clean the bowl. And if you want to like do a scrubbing to your bowl, you can also egg, add some eggshell. Yeah, mm. then it's very shiny after you clean it. So one whole jar of lemonade is done in just six seconds. Yeah, and then imagine you're having lemonade in uh, maybe in a Starbucks or things like that. It probably costs you like maybe 15 to 18 ringgit because it is so expensive outside. But uh, with the Romix, you can just use, uh, just do from scratch. Uh. Yeah. yeah. So now um, 
let's go back to Anna. Anna just now um, did her stir fry bihun. She just threw her bihun in already. Yes, so I just put my noodles inside. So just now, um, after I soaked my bihun, I actually um, strain it with this Maroma dish. So can you see there's actually whole. So it's actually multi-purpose. You can actually put in one whole chicken in this to steam, all right? So it's actually quite cool. You can even um use it as a salad spinner, but this has no steam. What you do is just replace it with a cover. Let me show you the cover. Yeah. So you just replace it with the cover and then you just shake off the excess water. Okay. So this is like oh, multi-use. Yeah. Okay. So it's actually quite okay. cool. You can even steam your vegetable, your eggs your chawamushi so basically you just add in like the cups inside and then just stack it on and then just cook so it's really quite cool yeah. it's yeah. really uh, everything is multifunctional so whatever you buy is really have the value in it and i really do think it doesn't uh, occupy a lot of your kitchen space is something really worth uh, your investment yeah so um Christian says she have to leave and thank you for sharing such information. Okay, thank you for joining us. But uh, do stay through the whole process because later we'll be announcing the winner and we only uh, uh, give away the, the prize to people who stay through the whole event. Uh. Yeah, Lisa said, what material is this made of? So this is a uh, food grade material, uh, BPA free one. So you don't have to worry that uh, this this uh, Varuma tree is harmful to your body. But apparently, right, last time uh, we do have advisors, they, they went to Paris to visit their uh, factory and things like that. And the, the staff actually told her that, you know, the material that uh, we are using on this Varuma, right, can eat one. They, they actually eat in front of her. Yeah, so whatever you are using is really very safe and you don't have to worry about the quality. Okay, now while we are waiting, uh, how long more your... My Mihun will have another 14 seconds and then okay. I'm done. Yeah, 14 seconds as you can see Anna got nothing to do and her hair is still tidy, not oily. Her face is still very shiny. If you are doing it in a regular way or maybe in a traditional way, you probably sweating already because you need to chow the me from like that with your hands. Okay, all right. So... So next step will be to just um, put my spatula in to stir. Okay, and for this step, right, I will actually opt this one out because I've actually tried putting my spatula in and what happens is that it cut my noodles. So I will actually um, do the stirring part manually later when I pour it into a bowl. I will use a thong to just like, you know, um, to just flip it through, all right? Okay, so just two more minutes and then... You let it, uh, let the bihun actually soak up all the sauce. Yeah, okay. So two more minutes and then we're done. And then I'll proceed to make my curry chicken, my curry pork. Yeah, okay. Then now we will have Siu Yun to, uh, to share about cookie do. Okay, so uh, I'll talk about cookie do. So uh, you, want, you want to share your screen? Yeah. 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 Let me open it up first. How many of you are interested with cookie do? Can I have uh, like a share of number if you are interested? Take one or maybe you want to know more. Yeah. Okay, so cookie do is a platform for us to look for recipe and ideas of cooking. So uh, we have the web base as well as in your machine is actually connected to cookie do. So after you lock in, and you can search for like, for example, you have a lot of chicken in your fridge and you don't know what to cook, then you can search for chicken for the recipe and it comes out tons of them. We have like 70,000 recipe in Kukiru itself. Yeah, this gives you all the ideas and you can also add this into your week. Like if you want to cook today, you can add to today or tomorrow up to one week. Okay, so this shows all the ingredients uh, that you need to prepare for these dishes and it also shows the total times that you need and what is the portion. So if let's say you are cooking for a family of four and if the recipe is, is a six person, six portions, then you can actually 
uh, cal calculate the, I mean, you, you just need, as long as you know maths, then you know how to like half it or whatever on your ingredients. And these are all guided cooking. So uh, like what I showed just now, you can go to the steps and then you can follow through. So even if halfway, like what you wouldn't mention just now, you cooking fried bee hoon halfway and you are having a stomach ache, you need to rush for a toilet, you can ask your husband or even kids. They, they just need to press next to continue the process. So yeah, it's very convenient. And um, yep, yeah, we can... We can add to our shopping list. Just now we add to our weeks, add to our shopping list. So if you are asking your husband to go for grocery, grocery shopping, you can just uh, share the shopping list to him. You don't even need to actually copy it. Uh, you can share and here you can copy and send it to your husband. So it's so easy. You know, husband, sometimes you tell him this ingredients they might not know. So uh, this is so easy, you don't, need, don't even need to type it. Yeah. Okay. So there is also another one that you were trying to show just now. We also have this collection. Yeah, it's, it's just like a, a recipe book that uh, is all related to chicken. So uh, yeah, you can go in each of them to look for the dishes that you would like to try. And this is very good, right? In with kukido, sometimes a lot of dishes we never think of cooking, and we we don't even know how to. So without this, uh, last time probably you will search for YouTube and then you will have to like brush through the steps and how to cook it before you start cooking. But with kukido, after you find the recipe, you just have a glance on the uh ingredients, and if you have all of them, you can start cooking at any time. You do not really need to look through what's the steps because it's a guided cooking. So you just need to follow. Yeah. And there are really, really a lot of recipe. Even if you are a health freak, uh, you can look for a low calorie or if you are on a keto diet, you can look for a keto uh, recipe. We have a lot of them in Kikidu. Yeah, you can actually search like keto diet. Very interesting uh, for people who are on keto diet, you can really consider because, you know, you have really very limited choices of food, right? This is something that really uh, really can help you a lot. Uh. And we do have collections as well. See keto meal, meal prep, keto friendly, uh, maybe, you know, uh, all kinds of low carbs meal that you can think of. Uh. Yeah. Hmm. So, and the synchronous to your machine is actually seamless. The moment you add it to your cooking, uh, your meal plan. And the next minute you on your machine, you will see it right there. Yeah. So you can it's see here. Yeah. Yeah. So like you can plan your meal ahead because you, uh, maybe you are a very, very busy person. So you can actually add all this into your calendar. Yeah. So yeah. let me show you my calendar. As you can see that day I cook uh, this yu tou fen ki tang and then herb bread. All these are in my calendar. Very interesting. So you can see these three days I'm resting. I'm not cooking anything. Yeah, you see? I did matcha uh, cheese foam drink for uh, no tea time. I did this cotton soft cheesecake, uh, fried bihun. You can see all this in your calendar. So when you really need some, you know, like cooking, if you're cooking alone, uh, you really sometimes really need a lot of inspirations. <laughs> yeah, especially you can link to our home. phone. Yes, Cookie Do can link to our phone. You can actually view here. So Anna, are you ready? Yes, I am. Okay. All right. I'll also put the mantle to steam. Yeah. yeah. Okay. Yep. Thank you. I poured my, my bihun into the plate already. Look at how amazing it is. Okay, let me show you. It actually is still quite long strands ish. Maybe I'm just too rough. Okay, look, it's still like it's not it's not exactly breaky, but you can see how amazing the mommy is. You can actually stir fry a bihun. All right, okay, so without further ado, I'm gonna start my, my curry pork. Hang on, stay tuned with me. Okay, so this recipe is done. I'm gonna put finish. I'm going to go next 
And then I'm going to go to my wheat and then curry. So look, it says curry chicken right here, but I'm actually substituting my protein with pork, okay? So I'm going to put start cooking. So I've washed my bowl. So you can see, right, my bowl is actually still kind of dripping wet. Can you see water going out? But it's totally fine as long as these five pins are dry, okay? So make sure these five pins are dry when you actually attach to the machine because let me bring it to a closer look. Can you actually see, I don't know what happened to my lighting today. It's so off. Ah, can you actually see these five pins down here? So these five pins actually attached to this screen, okay? So you have to make sure that your, your pins are always dry so that um, it's safe. Lah, okay? So basically, it says put a large bowl over this thermomix. So because they want to weigh the pork, right? We're going to season the pork. So a large bowl. I'm going to use this basin. Yes. Sorry, my bad. So a large container above this thermomix, okay? And then instead of three whole chicken, I'm just gonna pour in 500 grams of pork. So I'm using pork shoulder cut into slices. It's like fillet already. Okay, so next up, I will need to season it with curry powder. So curry powder, I use the Baba's one. And I'm going to put 10 grams only because I don't want it to be too spicy. All right, so just 10 grams. So you can reduce if you don't want it too spicy, all right? So basically, we are actually making the taste from scratch. Let me see. Okay, so next up, I'm going to put in some salt. If you don't want to use salt, you can actually use chicken stock powder. So this is a chicken stock powder that I actually made with the thermal mix, all right? Also everything, um, yeah. natural ingredients, all right? Yeah, great thing about thermal mix, you can do all kind of yonya paste, tom yum paste, everything from scratch. Like you really taste everything from scratch. That's right. So basically, this pork, I have to marinate it for a while. So I'm just going to set it aside. Okay, next up, I'm going to put in dry chilies. Okay, let's just go through the thing. Dry chilies, garlic cloves, um, shallots or onions. So I'm just going to just throw everything in. I already prepped them right here. Okay, so if you don't have candle nuts or you don't know what candle nuts are, um, you can actually substitute candle nuts with um, cashew nuts or pine nuts. Okay, I actually ran out of So I'm going to mix. I'm going to put cashew nuts and also some pine nuts. All right. Why we actually put all this because we want uh, we want our our curry to be slightly thicker or if you prefer a diluter di a more saucy kind of kind of curry you put in more water later okay so that's done turmeric I don't have fresh ones so I'm going to put in the powdered ones yeah. So as you can see, uh, Anna is doing curry from scratch. Last time you always buy instant pack, right? So you have to store right, really a lot of instant packs at home and instant packs are not cheap. And actually you can actually use these natural ingredients to, um, to make curry already. You don't need to store so much of different, maybe like asam paste, maybe like curry paste, curry fish paste, like all kind of paste. You can just buy like maybe like really basic ingredients and just marinate it and you can taste all the natural uh, 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 fragrance and like really, it really tastes different. Yeah, as compared to the instant packs one. Yep. Right. And you can even replace uh, ingredients as well. So let's say they say they want galangal. And if you don't have galangal, you can actually put ginger. But I've got galangal right here. So I'm just going to toss it right in. Okay, yeah. next up, vegetable oil. Because we are going to... Uh, you miss, you miss the sambal. So imagine you are, you are actually using a frying pan. I tell you, your kitchen will be in a mess. Because the sambal will, uh, will, will boil and then really splatter all around your kitchen. Uh. And then you have to clean the tabletop, you have to clean the, the, the what's that? Uh, the, 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 the wall, the wall. Oh, the wall. <laughs> Sorry. Yeah, okay, so the make wall. the base super easy. Just 20 seconds and then speed 10. 
Yeah, this you just literally will... throw everything in and then just blend into a paste. And then together at the same time, you have to, uh, you can stir fry everything in the same pot. So the last time, right, imagine uh, you, you will watch your YouTube video. You saw all these steps, you already don't feel like making. That's why you never thought of making from scratch. As you can see just now, and I just throw, 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 throw things, everything inside. Uh, like if you well prepared, everything prepared already, right, just, one shot throw inside and then 10 seconds. That's how I do for all my uh, chili or maybe like Thai sauce and all that. I also use the same method. Yeah. Okay, so this is my curry paste because I actually put a lesser, lesser chili. So it's like yellowish. Okay, so if you prefer it to be redder, you can actually put in chili powder. Okay, so I think I will put in some chili powder in a while. Okay. okay so now I will try the. the the, the chili paste. So everything will happen in the same pot, okay? Correct. So everything in. So let's say if I don't have fresh curry leaves, I can actually opt this one out. So I just go next. No lemon grass, I can skip also. I've actually skipped this multiple times. Okay, so I'm just gonna cook the curry paste and it will only take eight minutes to cook the curry paste. Okay, so in and cook. That's all. See you all back in eight minutes. Yeah, so eight minutes. During this time, maybe I'll share more about the function of the Thermomix. Yeah, so you can get the right temperature, like everything very precise. Like for example, you have baby at home, you want to feed them food, you can actually throw your ingredients in and leave it at 37 degrees. So you won't uh, feed them like a uh, very hot food or uh, undercooked food. Lah. Yeah. So you can also use a slow cook mode. Just now somebody asked, uh, told me that uh, she prefer the ceramic pot, but actually Thermomix already have this slow cook mode. So you can just throw your ingredients in. You can make like braised lamb and then braised duck and maybe like red bean soup, maybe that things that take longer time to cook. So yeah, you can cook up to eight hours. So yeah, you can also make yogurts at home. So if you have kids at home, uh, I think yogurt is really one of the very good desserts or maybe breakfast for them. Uh. And you only need one starter and you can remake yogurt and again and again using Thermomix. Yeah. So you don't need like extra yogurt maker. And also this uh, egg boiler and uh, sous vide machine. Yeah, sous vide machine uh, in the market is really not cheap, like at least like 2,000 ringgit at least. So um, yeah, with Thermomix, you actually save up a lot because you reduce in um, buying a lot of uh, all kinds of different, different kind of kitchen appliances. You just need one, yeah. And it doesn't occupy a lot of your space at home. Uh. Yeah, so benefits of cooking with uh with Thermomix is really quick and easy. You can see Siri is not doing anything. She's standing there doing things that quick and easy. She can just go, now she can go and fold her clothes, maybe clean uh her laundry, uh have time with her kids. Yeah, I think that's really very important. Or maybe you can engage your kids together to cook with you. Yeah, eat more healthier and most importantly, it has this auto cook washing who doesn't love auto washing yeah i really very love the uh love the function a lot lah, because it really saved me a lot of time yeah so now uh um uh, uh once you purchase this the moment right if it's full payment you do get this uh carry back with you yeah so let me share a bit about the benefit of joining us so as you can see um we are a community that is uh really uh one of the top uh, in Malaysia market. Lah. So all our advisors are very, very active. So as long as they share like really interesting menus, right, it somehow motivates you to try different menu as well. I really do feel that it's very, very important. And we do have uh, a lot of demos in a month. And we also have a lot of, um, I said, uh, uh, cooking, cooking class for you all to learn along. And then we do have this uh, community called Ben. Let me share a bit with you. So if you are worried that I, uh, I buy already, I don't know how to use then how? So this is the Ben app. Let me show you. This is our uh, community uh, platform. So everyone here are very actively sharing about their food. You see yesterday we actually mixed siu bao. I'm, I'm the one who taught them to do the siu bao. So it's very, very interesting. And then the other day we have this Daifuku class. Yeah, like 
um, you never thought of doing Daifuku, right? Because you don't know how, or maybe you see the video is very, very tough. But here we have like uh, teachers to teach us how to do all these little things. And pandan layer cake. And then what is this? Uh, hong sao ro. Thermomix hong sao ro is really one of the must try. So once you get your thermomix, this is really uh, one of the things that you need to try. La. So yeah, we are actively uh, sharing in this group. Yeah, you, we also have a lot of uh, recipes that we share, that shared by uh, our advisor. Maybe they found out a better, better recipe and things like that. So everything is video guided, so you can also follow their recipes. So I really do think that this is a very fun, fun platform to, to join. Uh, as you can see, a lot of uh, uh, people sharing their, their food every day. Yeah, so... Uh, also, you can find a lot of these uh, recipes here. It's like an album. So whenever you want to look for something, like for example, you want to uh, stir fry noodle, but you don't know which one to follow, then you can uh, browse through. Like it's really a lot. Lah. Yep. That's one fun part. And then, yeah, uh, there's a chat room also. So you can chat in the group chat. Yeah. So that there, there will be like, 2,000 people in the chat room. So whenever you ask questions, people will share their, their, their ideas or so. Yeah. So for any questions. So now, right, once you purchase your Thermomix, it comes with a free gift, which is this thermal server. I don't have it, I don't have it with me. But uh, this thermal server, server, right, like for example, just now Anna, she did her stir fry bihun already, she can just store her bihun inside this uh, uh, server and it will serve warm long. Yeah, you can also ferment your dough inside this thing, uh, this thermal server and uh, the size of the thermal server is same size as the thermomix bowl. So whenever you cook soup or whatever, right, you can just pour it in and it will not overflow and things like that. The volume is just nice. Uh, okay, maybe uh, is it the time to to announce the winner for the lucky draw already. Anna. All right. Okay, let me share screen. Okay, are you guys ready? So yeah, okay. Uh do bear in mind that uh this this lucky draw, right? We only give to the participants who stay through our live session, okay? So if your friends already went out, please ask them to join in. As you can see, your name is, is on this, uh, what is this called? The Wheel of Fortune, yeah. So there will be a chance for you to win, okay? All right, you guys ready? Let's go. <laughs> Angel Long, is Angel Long around? Can we have the winner, Angel? If you are here, can you all can you all just type I'm here? Then we can keep the prize for you. Is Angel around? Going once. Going twice. Uh oh. Sorry, Angel. If you all are not in, in here, right? Then we will have to leave give it to other person already. Okay, next one. Lam one cent sixty eight. I I he is in this chat. Hello. Hi, winner. <laughs> I don't know how to pronounce your name. Can you type in? You're here. Yes, I saw you're in the. Yeah, so you are the winner for this, uh, for this lucky draw. Congratulations. So later, maybe you can claim the prize from Anna, right? Yeah, yes, you can. So mm. I'll type my number down below. What you can do is you just WhatsApp me, 993 Yeah, we have our first winner. Congratulations. Yay. Okay, so if you cannot reach me on my phone, you can DM me on WhatsApp or on on Instagram, yeah, okay. Also can the oh. box of uh, prizes is really very good because it's uh, uh from this. What is that? What's the name already? Yeah, Radiant Whole Food. Radiant Whole Food. Sorry. That's okay, right. next winner, please. 
Okay, before we go to the next video, let me put in my pork, okay? Yeah, let her put in <laughs> your Because I need, that, I need another eight minutes. She will have to take a longer time. All right, hey, my mantel is ready. I can also show you now. Yeah. <laughs> Lana, oh, I'm so ready. Okay, so this is my curry paste. Yeah, okay, we let Anna continue. <laughs> okay, this is my curry paste. I actually put in some Korean red pepper so that it's red. All right. Mm -hmm. Okay, so now I'm going to put in the Okay. So, there. Let me put you here facing. Okay. So, protein in, next will be, I'm going to skip these potatoes because I don't like my potato all mushed up inside. Okay, 100 grams of water. I'm going to the water. I don't like it too wet or too dry. Okay, next up, instant measuring cup. Just cook for uh, eight minutes will do. Okay, and that's all. All right. Oh, she just have to leave it to cook well. Yeah. Yes, yes. So okay. can we have the second winner already? Of course. All right. The chances of winning is quite high, you know, because today we don't really have much participants. Ma Diana, is Diana here? Can can you say I'm here so we can get the prize for you? Is Diana here? Let me check the participant. Oh, there's no Diana here. Leh. Going once. Diana, going twice. You here? Are Sorry. You here? I don't think she's here. I don't I don't see any Diana here. Okay, okay. let's go. Second winner. Hello, I'm here. <laughs> oh, you're here? Congratulations! Wow, congrats! Thanks. <laughs> yeah, later you text Anna for the prize, okay? Yeah. Okay, okay. okay we have one more winner. Okay, yeah. last one. Lucky draw thing makes me awake. Yeah. Everyone awake, huh? we have last winner here. Huh? Last one, last one already. Stay tuned, stay tuned. Li Mingying. Is Li Mingying here? Let me check. Yeah, Mingying is here. Congrats. Yay. Today we have like two Congratulations. So later you can text Anna. The, the, the phone number is in the chat. So you all can claim your Radiant Hope Food gift. Yeah. So there's Bihun inside. There's Sesame Seed inside. Eh, I know sesame oil inside, like really good prizes. Uh. Because I received it yesterday, I really like the gift a lot. Yeah. And there's like yes, organic salt really. and things like that. Yeah. So mm -hmm. that's very interesting. Okay. Anna, Anna's side will take like uh, maybe another five, five minutes. more minutes. Cook, okay. So maybe we can ask Yuyin to share her mantel. Okay. Yuyin. Now, oh, wow. the mantel is ready. Yeah, you can see the shiny surface. Yes. And I think this will be it's so nice, easy. Right? See, just now, I just need like five minutes, three minutes mm. to make the dough, two minutes to break up the yeast. And then I just do a very simple shaping. So if you have time, you can do into a pumpkin shape. Last time I do into a pumpkin shape or you can do a flower. Anything that you like because that's really the fun part. That yeah. we, we just need to handle it. And it's so easy. The, the doll is so uh, easy to handle. It's not, it's not sticky. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Your daughter wants to eat the mantle already. She cannot tie already. It's very bouncy. When you press it down, then it will just come up. Yeah. 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 As you can see, right, we started off from flour until this shape of mantle. Everything is made from scratch. I really do think that's really wonderful. Without the mommies, we went, we, we were never thought of doing mantle, correct? Yeah. <laughs> And also the curry chicken, that recipe, if you own a Thermomix, you need to try that out. It's really good. And chicken stock, the chicken stock, yeah, the chicken yeah. stock powder, that's the must. Because yeah. in like every, almost every dishes, you can actually replace that with salt. 
and you eat more healthy, you know there's no preservative and what you put it in to make that into the powder. Yes. So yeah, your, your kids and your families can eat more healthy and we can basically do everything yeah, from A to Z, everything from scratch. Yeah, especially nowadays during COVID, right? I'm sure a lot of you maybe like take out a lot or maybe grab food a lot. Like having thermomics at home, right? We really cook a lot and I really do think it's a safer option. Uh. Maybe Suyin, you can share with us uh, how thermomics benefits your daily life. Yeah, um, for me, because like everyday kids stay at home, right? They, they have no outdoors activities and the only thing is eat. <laughs> A lot of time they will ask mommy what can what can we eat what can we eat so before having a thermomix you will scratch your head even you want to make something then you you want to bake a cake you have to bring out your mixer and later on you have to clean it's so oily you know the batter usually is very oily so with thermomix everything you just dump it in then it's clean by itself some more so and your your kids can actually play baking together with you so we we don't run out of ideas like for breakfast. Last time we have to think like then we have to order Grab and Grab is so expensive. The food in Grab is like 30% uh, more than the original price. You have to pay the extra 30% and some more you have to pay for delivery fees. And it takes time to deliver to your house. With Thermomix, you can put it in. Maybe it's you can get it ready like within 15 to 30 minutes. Uh, a beautiful breakfast is ready in front of you so this really benefits our family yeah and i really really enjoy uh, using it and uh also joining the right team it gives you the motivations and you will never run out of uh, idea of what you want to try out next because the group like they always have different different kinds of we have a lot of cooking class like this afternoon, we have a cooking class for our ACE customers to make dim sum. So yeah. we can, uh, you can learn how to make uh, siu mai. You can learn how to make the ji uh, chong fen. Yeah, it's really fun and you will never get bored of this. Trust me, you will never get bored of this and you will never put it to a side without using it, without fully utilizing it if you are joining the right team. This is really, really important. Yeah, joining the right team is really very important. Yeah, yeah. especially following the right advisor. Uh, uh, ensure you are uh, buying from the advisor that can help you along the way. Yeah. Thank you, Siri, for sharing. Okay, maybe I'll share a little bit more. Uh, Okay, actually, I was a TM5 user before this. So actually, I, I uh, upgraded to TM6 because TM6 really have like a much better version. Like for example, I can stir, I can fry my onions, I can fry my ikan bilis like effortlessly without uh, like oily oily kitchen. And I used to be a conventional cooker, like I cook in a conventional way. And I really do think the kitchen is very, very hot and I don't like to clean up the mess. So uh, Thermomix really helps me a lot and I I, I can share it with y'all uh, like what I do every single day. Lah. So bread making almost every day, we are doing it already. So let me show you uh, what I did during the past. So I actually cooked this guy, see how fun. Yeah, you can do it with Thermomix. Yeah, and it is a very, very simple process. No, no, no messy kitchen and you can cook like really very nice spicy ho fun. Yeah, so what else? And then uh, Korean pancakes. Let me show you. And then I did uh, tofu pa as well. So you can really explore really a lot of dishes that you have never tried before. Like maybe this Hokkien mee, uh, tofu pa, uh, this uh, steam steam rice that can easily be done in like 20 minutes and then this mochi uh, sesame paste like really a lot of things like banana cake everything bread mantou yeah i even did this um you know uh shallots i peel my shallot skin with thermomix so it, it's very very impressive uh. as you can see the shallot skin already removed from the from the shallots. So I really do think it really helps me along with my uh, cooking journey because uh, it has like 
many, many ways to use with it. Uh. So not just like cooking simple things. Uh. So many other things like potato bread. Like nowadays we only eat like food that is freshly made from our kitchen. Uh. We hardly deliver it anymore. So I do think like, it, like uh, you eat more like outside food, right? It's not so uh, uh, healthier option. Uh. Okay, so now I'll be sharing this uh, free gift that um, once you purchase this Thermomix, like one whole set, so it comes with this uh, thermal server. So what you can do with this thermal server, right? You can make tau fu fa. A lot of people buy this thermal server because they want to make tau fu fa. This can really make a very silky smooth tau fu fa. And then you can store your, maybe your fried bihun inside and uh, keep it warm uh, over time uh. and then you can knead your dough you can just ferment your dough in the in the thermal server and ice cubes you can also uh, like keep cold stuff in the thermal server and this is really multifunctional and i really do think this free gift is really worth uh for you all to purchase and it comes free with your thermomix now so do grab your chance and because this one is while stock last once company announced right then there will not be any more thermal server already and this is not for sale item so do grab your chance okay the promotion is until next week only so uh do grab a chance and don't miss out this promotion as a lot of people are waiting for this promotion. I myself, when I buy, I, it doesn't come with this thermal server at all. Yeah, so it also comes with this cookbook. Cookbook is something I really love. So you can choose the English version or the Chinese version. So inside, there will be a lot of nice pictures as, as you all can see. And not just recipes inside, it does share a lot of, you know, like, functions and how you can utilize it like really a lot of uh, information inside here so do grab your chance and uh, order it from your advisor today and today this afternoon we do have dim sum class and you can learn along with us yeah so um, quickly get a thermomix from us and then we will um, arrange the necessary stuff for you and then you can join us to learn cooking together yeah so Anna is your site ready I've got 40 more seconds. So what I put in just now is I put in coconut milk, sugar, and also some water. No, coconut, coconut milk and sugar. Okay, so we're only down with 28 more seconds because you're actually mixing the coconut milk. Okay, so... Yeah, the, and now maybe you can share with us how the thermomix benefits our life. Oh, okay. So um, I actually cook manually actually, but then I don't like the washing part. Because when you're cooking, right, you actually have to stand by the stove to actually cook. And then if you don't do that, um, what happens is that your food might burn, right? So with the Thermomix, when you actually cook it, when you're actually, when you're actually cooking, you can actually wash because you don't have to stir. Like the Thermomix will actually stir for you. Like for now, my curry is ready. Let me show you. Yeah, looks good. Someone is going to <laughs> Yeah, okay. So I will pour into a bowl first and then I'll show you. So it's so easy to make curry, like curry pork in like less than half an hour and it's done. And yeah, uh, and then you know sometimes curry pot, uh, once you clean right, your 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 sponge will soak with curry already. So yes, yeah, the yeah. makes do the cleaning for you. You don't even use the sponge to to wash your bowl. Correct. Right. So it's very very easy and just like that, I have my my bihun and my yeah the buffet style <laughs> so my bihun, bihun and, and curry. Yeah. yeah, okay. Yeah, today our, all our dishes is done. Suing, can you show your lemonade and uh, uh, manto to everyone? Yeah, so you, as you can see, in less than uh, one and a half hour, I think today we, we really strike at one and a half hour. Yeah, in one and a half hour, we completed four dishes. Manto, lemonade, uh, curry chicken, and stuff fried bihun. Come on, it's a set already. Yeah, yeah. So, and we are using lesser... Uh, cost to cook all this like so yeah so if you all are interested with this thermomix do get your do get your um the your advisor contact and order it from her yeah okay can we have a picture with all the presenters yeah and thank you all for joining us today and congratulations to all the winners today
enjoy your free gift from Radiant Whole Food. Yeah. Thank, thank, thank you, you everyone. It's a very nice session Happy today. Weekend. Happy okay, weekend. thank you for staying through the whole session. I hope this session helps you all to uh, learn more about the thermomics function and know how it can benefit your uh, daily cooking life. Yeah, thanks, Lily. Thanks, uh, Xiao Jiao Shu. And yeah, thank you all for staying through this session. Yeah, I hope you all enjoy this session. Thank you. Thank bye you. Bye. Congratulations again.